So in this video, we are going to learn how to add 3D models and create 3D models to add in a PowerPoint presentation. So first, in your laptop, you can go to the type here button. Then you can search for 3D viewer. Now as you can see when you open it, first some, some uh, model will come. So you can go to the 3D library and search for whatever you want. For example, I'm going to take this butterfly. Now it's loading, so let's wait. So here it is. This is the butterfly. So you can rotate it up, down, left, right, back anywhere so this model doesn't have animations so uh, you can uh, also take a uh, bit with, with anima animations then after this is here you can go to this file button and save as and save it to your computer and then you don't need this tab now you can open the presentation which in which you want to add the butterfly. So we don't need this. So we can remove this. And then you can go to the insert tab. And you can see this option called 3D models. When you click there, you can go to wherever you have saved the uh, 3D model and select it. And insert now this model is here so now I need it this big and then I will add some text beside it so with this button you can uh, adjust the angle whichever angle you want or you can go uh, to format and then adjust the angle for example left top back right etc so now i want it as a right so then i will take it here and then you can go to the you have to select this 3d model and go to animation tabs you see this five animations so you can choose anyone for example if i choose turnable it will take a full round and then come back to its place as you can see If I do swing, then it will just swing from left to right or right to left. If I do jump and turn, it would jump and then take a turn and come back. If I do leave, then it will go. So if I do turn, now when I go on slideshow, when I click the next button, it starts turning by itself. You don't need to click on it. Then, when it's done, it will stop by its own self. Like this. So, so, that was how you add and make a 3D model in a PPT. So, hope you enjoyed learning how to add and make a PPT and make a 3D model in a PPT. See you soon with a new video on Asta and Bansri.